Hey guys, welcome to the channel. It's Yoel and Nate again. And we got a 67 Camaro RS. And you go, man, another Camaro. And in the beginning when I saw this car, I was like, yeah, whatever, right? But when you hear the motor on this car yeah. and the way it is, you call it the Hot Wheel, yeah. right? This is real life Hot Wheels. Yeah, yeah, this is like... So we just wanted to show it because we saw so many modern builds that we love. But this car is the ultimate old school built. Yeah. Like it was built a long time ago and this is how he was back in the day. Nate was fun, making fun of me because he's like, that's how your cars were when in high school. I'm like, I don't think so, but okay, I wasn't that old, but yes, well, this is kind of the Pro, era. Pro Street already died out when I was in high school. So it was already going like Pro Touring, like what we build now. Yeah. Even though that was, I mean, 20 years ago almost yeah. now. But it's still, that it's, was already the style. So you don't even see Pro Street anymore. Yeah. No it's one It's probably Pro my Street. era, but I've yeah. never had cars with the tires stick out like that. <laughs> but it's super cool. What attracted me to this car is the sound of the engine. Way when you guys hear this thing. It's it good. is. It's, yeah. it's unbelievable. So we just got a 383 stroker, okay, that looks like it's built. Some Edelbrock heads and a 671 blower by the blower shop. This guy's a legendary. And it's hilarious that everyone that's come into the shop has been like, what's up with that car? We're like, are you guys joking? You know what I mean? It's just like, a, but I get it. It's like a real life Hot Wheels car. It's, so yeah, it's so I got, I got this car from a friend of mine that bought it at Barrett Jackson, okay? And he owns everything by McLaren, GT3s. He's never owned the muscle car. And this is the first muscle car he bought and had no clue. And it wasn't running. It was like, it was pretty messed up. Yeah. And he brought it to me. He goes, I I'm never going to drive it. Fix it and sell it for me. Then I sell it to a local guy that comes in in like a Rolls Royce. And he's like, oh, I love this thing. I want to buy it. He buys it and comes right back. He goes, ah, I don't know that. I go, yeah, yeah it's a lot not, of cars. Yeah. You need yeah. to know about these yeah. cars, right? And then, of course, Angie, our friend that knows what's up, yeah. sees it. She goes, I want it. <laughs> I go, you do? She goes, yeah, that looks super cool with the blower sticking yeah. out of the hood. I say, yeah, you can have it. So Angie bought it. And Angie owns lots of cartoonish cars. You know, she has cars with body kits and, you know, it's very, it's, I see the style. I could see it. Yeah. It's like but, over the top. But she also owns Carrera GT. Yeah, yeah, no. That she's going to let us do too. that. It's, she's got yeah, yeah. McLaren's. Yeah. She's got the right collection. Yeah. But she loved this thing. She's like, this is so cool. Not only that she loved it, she leaves a lot of her cars in the U.S., but she asked us to ship this back to the Philippines. So here's an old school, the most American 67 Camaro flying into the Philippines and, and, and going to be used down there. That would be cool. And they, they, they don't see stuff like no, that. No. One thing is, Madeline, that you got to show like how old school is that a lot of the young viewers don't probably even know. Back in the day when we drag race, we used to put a chain on the block so it doesn't rip, rip the mounts. Yeah, you don't You know you don't what I mean? It your... doesn't over twist the yep. motor. So we used to chain them up. This is very, very old school build, twin carbs, you know, four miles per gallon. Yep. You know, this is the kind of stuff we used to love. That, we have the hood prop because this hood weighs about 150 pounds. So, At least. Yeah, it's heavy. Uh, cool old school wheels, American Racings. Uh, we put the Toyos on it. Yeah. We like Toyo tires, so we threw those. We, it's got got a, we got it running good. We did a, a little tune up on it and stuff. And oh, yeah, we did it. a yeah. lot of work to yeah. it, a lot of cleanup. Uh, it's got Sparkle seats, and it's got, and I don't, I'm not crazy about those shifters, but when you drag racing, yeah. you need them. Yeah. It's got the TCI yeah, Outlaw shifter, shifter, the ratchet. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's always, you got to remember how to put it in reverse. You ain't getting away fast from anywhere, yeah. but when you drag racing, yeah, it's, it's nice just to yeah, hit it. Uh, and this is what this thing is built for. Uh, we're not going to spend a lot of time on it. Wheelwood brakes. We just thought it was super cool. Nate, just you wanna... the engine noises. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's crispy. Noises. You want to help me put the hood down so they can see how this thing sticks out? Yeah, if this hood falls yeah, on you, I got you're, you're I got in trouble. It. Yeah, I got it. Yeah. So here it is. That's the look with the hood closed. It's not the perfect car, but it's super cool. They literally built the hood around the supercharger, and it's already got a big cow. So we always laughed when we were in high school. We had a lot of guys with this... Yeah, six seventy ones and all that, <laughs> and we always say if a little kid crosses the street and you're making a right turn, you'll never see yeah, him. Yeah. So you gotta oh, be yeah. careful. You probably yeah. see him. I'm gonna be behind, <laughs> behind the supercharger. Uh, let's go to the rear real quick. Uh, just very old school. You know, it's not Lord. 
You can see how it's sitting, the stance. This is a very, very old school. We're not gonna lift it. We're not gonna spend a, t a ton of time on it, but 67. But this, but this used to be the look. You have the tires sticking out. You, a lot of people would do a shackle kit, maybe some air shocks so they could jack up the rear. Yeah. Yeah, was, uh, this, this is, is cool. old school, yeah. Yeah, very cool. By the way, 67 Camaro, first year for the Camaro. Okay, then they went 68, they changed them. The quickest way to see for me if it's a 67 or 68, the 68s lost this little angle window. So 68s doesn't have it. That's how I could tell right away. Tail lights are different. There's other differences. Yeah. And then 69, they changed the car again. You can see the fins in the 69. There's other ways to tell the 69, the front turn singles changed. Uh, and 69 looks like a wide body yeah, almost, yeah. you know, it flares out yeah. a little more, has a little more muscle. And that's the most desirable year. Yeah. 70s are coming up, 70 and a half split bumpers are coming up. Uh, but yeah, super cool. I want to go drive it, uh, show you guys a little bit how this car runs. I actually haven't driven this car yet. Well, when one of our mechanics took it, he came back and he's like, this thing is amazing. And we're like, shut up. And he's like, no, seriously, this thing. Well, it sounds amazing. He, was just, he came back all excited. So you're probably going to love it. Let me start it up. Yeah, you're probably going to love it. Let's see the inside. Let me see if I can start this thing up. <laughs> sounds good. Old school shift light. Bruce Gage. With a shift light? Oh, yeah. Sounds great. <laughs> I love it. Brings it me back power. to the days. Yeah, you yeah. know my 69 Camaro when I had my 383 old built natural? It wasn't even supercharged when I used to run them. We used to run uh, like 14s in it, 13.9s at yeah. LACR on straight motor. Oh, yeah. It was a 383 built, 14 to 1 compression. Yeah. Uh, sound a lot like this. It reminds yeah. me a lot of that. Yeah. So super yeah, cool. Yeah, sounds amazing. All right, cool. Let's go for a ride. So wow, barely giving it a quarter throttle. It's smoking the brand new tires. Pretty nice. They didn't go for the ride. I don't know if he was scared, but we needed a driver for the for the chase vehicle, so he's in there. Uh, super cool car. And we're looking at a Tesla right in front of me and how far we came in so many years, you know? Look how the cars look so different. This is so old school, and then you got a full electric car in front of us, so interesting how the years have changed.
All right, guys, I'm back. Nate, you're sitting behind the car. You got to hear the motor. It looks you didn't fun. hear the supercharger, though. Supercharger sounds bitching inside. No, we can hear it. You can hear it? Oh, yeah. All right, I'm sorry. You happy. can hear it. Okay, 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 down, okay. Yeah. All right. That uh, guy in front of you could hear it, too. He was like... Yeah, he was giving me thumbs up. <laughs> so what do you think? It looks fun. I know you were a little scared it to go like in there with me after the yeah, Super after the B. Super B, I was like, I think you got it on your own. It's, <laughs> it's cool. It's a really cool car. I like it. Even my I mean, boy, you took that turn kind of fast for a straight line car. It, it's definitely a straight line <laughs> car. The one thing I notice is no matter what I did on the burnout, she didn't want to stay straight. Yeah. I, I don't know why, yeah. but she, she wants to pull to the right every time. I try yeah. to correct it a little bit, but there's too many cars. And, yeah. you know, I just had to lay it off. So another week burnout. I think it's but, a lot of power for the just the overall setup. What's the size of the rear tires? That's something we didn't talk about. Do we know? No. We're going to put it in there. Yeah. Madeline's going to put on the screen yeah. what size <laughs> tires we're running on the back because people are going to want to yeah, know how sure. we're smoking that yeah, much tire. Sure. Yeah. I don't know what kind of horsepower we're making. And the burnout, I, I don't know. The, you say a weak burnout. The burnout looked amazing. Did it? Yeah, it looked good. It felt weak. You yeah. know that I wasn't full. shooting rubber like all over the place. Nate, half throttle. Yeah. Three quarters oh, yeah. max. You can hear it. Because I, I felt bad for the new tires. It's like, like 3,000 RPM burnout, and it's just... And yeah. I shifted. Did you yeah. hear me shift? Yeah. I shifted. I was like, bam, bam. That's cool. <laughs> yeah, it was no, really cool. cool. Anyway, guys, I Come like on. this car. Nothing too crazy. We just wanted to show you guys like an old school, like classic old school, like how we used to build them back in the yeah, 80s. Yeah, really. This like an like 80s build. Before, yeah. I was yeah. born in the 80s, but this is before my time. It's really before your time, too. You weren't driving when people were building like this. Yeah, no, no, yeah, no. It's a little I'm, before. Yeah, I'm a 70s baby. Yeah, yeah. All right, cool. All right, guys, thanks for watching the channel. If you like it, please subscribe. Please share the videos with your friends. We need all the help we can get. We got to keep buying tires, so please help <laughs> us. All right? Thanks, guys.